Dear, you need your strength to face the day. <laughs> hey, you know, my mother thinks we'd make a cute couple. <laughs> uh, maybe we could go out sometime. Oh, if I was a deer, that Chester Dribble seems like an awfully nice boy. He's not a boy. He's a man. Hide from the hunters. So and he eight. lives I don't with his pants, mother. So my legs you live oh, with I your wish. mother? Then I'd be far, That's far different. How, dear? Mm, okay, I'm person. not creepy. Narcy. Besides, but he asks me out every say? day. Well, you should go out with him. Okay, oh, fine. Oh, dear, Anything I'm to get you off my back. And then I got a merit badge for holding my breath the longest. My cat coughed up a fur ball. Well, my mother thought it was the biggest one she ever saw. Have you ever seen that TV show? You know, what's it called? It's got that guy in it that does that thing, you know, that... Uh... Oh, the weed, you hamburgers, I love a good hamburger. Ooh, I love it. Oh, excuse did, me. Pardon me, did you say hamburger? Hamburger. You're home early. How was your date with Chester? Eat up, dear. You need your strength to face the day. Oh, wow. I had a great time last night. Did you? You know, we should do it again sometime. How about uh, next Friday? I don't want to deal with any more pirates. I hope you go back to your ship and sail away. You look bored, dear. Uh, you should go on a vacation. Okay. Fine. Whatever. Anything to get you off my back. Hey, planning a vacation? How did you guess? Well, you know, I'm, I'm very intuitive. My mother says I'm psychic. Psychotic? Not psychotic. No, wait, maybe that is what she says. You know, she mumbles under her breath sometimes. I, I don't think she likes me. Hey, maybe we should go out again. Oh, yeah. I'll call you. 
Oh, yeah, please do. You, uh, you have my number, right? Oh, yes, I have got your number. I need a break from my life. Where would you like to go? Away. Far away? Far, far, far away. The moon? Can you arrange that? No, but I have a place nobody wants to go. Send me there, please. It's called Frypanistan. It's just north of Stovtopia. Never heard of it. I'll take it. It could be dangerous. I'm in. Frypanistan? I've never heard of it, dear. Nobody has. That's what makes it a perfect vacation spot. Oh, I'm sorry. There are no flights to Frypanistan. What? Why? Well, nobody wants to go there. And besides, nobody's ever heard of it. But I bought a ticket! Oh, sorry. Kinda stinks to be you, doesn't it? I know it stinks to be me. It always stinks to be me. Look, I need a vacation in the worst way. Can I trade this ticket for another destination? Well, there's Lompoc. Lom what? Lompoc. It's a cute little town with plovers and murals. Occasionally, they launch rockets. I'll take it. I've never been to Lompoc. I hear it's nice this time of year. Have you ever been to Lompoc? No. What made you pick Lompoc? Because I couldn't get a flight to Frypanistan. Me too. We have so much in common. Seriously? Is, is that your pickup line? It usually works. On normal girls, that is. What is that supposed to mean? It means you have cooties, and I wouldn't marry you if you were the last person on Earth. Well, I'm glad we established who the crazy one is. And I treasure my cooties to scare away men like you. I was in Lompoc once. How nice. Will you marry me? Sure. Why not? She doesn't have cooties, and I'm going to marry her. Mazel tov. Terrific. Yes, it is terrific, so there. Hey, will you be my bridesmaid? Say no. You know what? Sure, I'll be your bridesmaid. You've always hated me. Yes, that much is true. Tell me, what gave it away? I've never been able to figure out what you really want. I want desperately to get off this plane. This is a hijack. You are all going to fight Palestine. <laughs> that was easy. If you keep calm, the will will get hurt. Well, will there be an in-flight movie? Hey, can we get some nuts back here? I'm starving. I'd like a beer and some cannabis, if you have it. Hey, do I look like a stewardess to you? It's not nice to judge people by their appearance. Yeah, yeah, so how about those nuts? And my beer. I am a hijacker. I want you to fear me. I'm a dangerous person. You shouldn't put yourself down like that. We like you just the way you are. This is going to be a long flight. Everybody off the plane. Say, please. 
Yeet off the plane! Please. The vacation from hell begins. I paid for first class. Hold on. Hold on. I is this part of the entertainment package? Things will get better if we meditate. Come on, people. Visualize with me. <laughs> I want a pony! <laughs> this is not the time to ask for a pony. It's never the right time to ask for a pony! Because you don't love me! <laughs> This must be what torture feels like. We've been talking to the President of the United States. Have they agreed to pay our price? Uh, no, um, we made the mistake of hijacking a plane with no celebrities or politicians. Really? Out of all the planes in the sky and we got a dud? It's worse. There isn't anyone on the plane worth more than a buck seventy-five. Oh, why does everything always happen to me? Well, what should we do with all of these worthless people? Put them to work. Where? I hear Burger Closet is hiring. Well, I don't know if they need 175 people, but I'll ask. Should they be paid below minimum wage? Paid? Just joking. <laughs> <laughs> Alright everybody, get to work. Make those burgers, fill those drinks. Golly, I've never worked this hard in my whole life. Get used to it. This will be our life from now on. Are you kidding me? This is my life when I'm not on vacation. Okay, no chatter, work. No. <gasps> uh, huh? Okay, listen up, burger boss. I am on vacation. I refuse to work. Are you standing up to my authority? Yes, I guess I am. Who's with me? No, no, she's acting alone. I like it here. Yeah, and I wanted to be the manager someday. You know, I don't even like her. She has cooties. You dare say no to a burger boss? Maybe. Nobody says no to a burger boss. She did. Shut up. I'm gonna be tortured? Beaten? Maybe. Are you scared? A, a, a little? Aren't you a lot scared? Uh, yes. Good. <laughs> Here's what I'm going to do. I'll let you slide this time if you promise me never to do it again. No. Excuse me? Um, she said no. Shut up! Are you usually this disobedient? Um, not usually. I've been having some personal problems lately. Not you. You know what? I've never been disobedient to anybody until now. Then why start now? Uh, I, I want to say yes, but no keeps coming out. Practice saying yes and it will get easier. No! Yes! No! Yes! No! Yes! No! Yes! No! No! Here's your gruel. Gruel? They take their obedience seriously here. Hello? Can I have some salt? <coughs> this has got to be a trap. The doors don't have locks? Hey, close that and you'll let the heat out. You're all free. Let's get out of here. Do we know where we're going? <laughs> I, I don't know, but I hope it's not fancy. I don't have anything to I wear. I hope there's ice cream. 
How do we get out of here? We can run back to the U.S. What about the ocean? I like the ocean. It has whales and dolphins and shrimp and lobster. Hey, look over there! This is too easy. I got a crazy feeling that something is going to happen. Someone is driving a school bus through the minefield. A school bus? Those poor kids! We need to alert their parents! I'm gonna lose my cookies. You got cookies? Wait a second, is this part of the entertainment package? Okay, all we need is to find a way to fly back to the U.S. The school bus is parked in back of the plane. The prisoners are escaping! You forgot to lock the cells again! Oh, sorry. I've been under such stress lately. <laughs> yeah, bus driver, get in there and fly this plane. I don't know how to fly a plane. It beggars. Looks like I'll be applying for the manager position at Burger Closet. Does anyone know how to fly an airplane? I do. I'm the pilot. Put your seat in an upright position. Extinguish all smoking materials. In the event of a loss of cabin pressure, Sir, the U.S. Marines are here to see you. They want the hostages back. Tell them I'm busy. Busy doing what? Busy running away. <laughs> Look what you've done. The Frypanny Air Force is going to shoot us down and we'll all die. I'll never get to be the manager of Burger Closet. Oh, honey, you would have been cute in your manager uniform. I know. You're both brain dead. Those are U.S. Marine fighter jets. What? What? The Marines are going to shoot us down? I knew it was all a big conspiracy. Okay. Those are Marines, and they're escorting us home. We're saved! Oh! Yeah. That makes a lot more sense. You think? What was your first clue? In other news, a plane was hijacked to Pripanistan. I don't know what that is either. In a clever ploy, the president told the hijackers that we didn't care about the passengers while secretly planning to send in the Marines to save them. While the Marines arrived, they discovered that a brave passenger had taken charge and got the others to a plane which was escorted home by Marine fighter jets. One passenger has stepped up to claim the credit for the rescue. But you know what? It was a harrowing experience. I knew I was going to have to take charge and muster all of my courage. I managed to command the respect of the others so I could lead them to safety. So all the passengers listen to your commands? All but one. A vile woman who had cooties. She almost ruined the whole rescue. Oh, welcome home, dear. How was your vacation? You look very rested. My life as just plain Jane is driving me quite insane. I seem to be born by quite plain. Each day seems just the same. So much of my life's been spent. Towards glory I have not been bent. But now I have a story that's great. A story that changed my fate. 
A day had come well on the run of a quite uneventful day. A danger appeared big and bold to behold. I was ready with my life to pay. Things happened so fast we were having a blast in flight through the sky at daybreak. When a hijacker, low and sneaky as a snake, did demand for our plane to take. My thinking was clear. I had to act fast, as the others all seemed to panic. I kept my head, and to safety I led. All the others so frantic and frightened, frantic and frightened, frightened and frantic. As proud as a peacock, I acted with faith, as the one and only to solve this case. By coming to the fore, conquering evil and more. I'm the heroine flying ace. I'm the heroine flying ace.